Hey everybody, it's Maggie Mulhern from Modern Salon TV. I am here with one of my BFFs, Frank Rosieri. It's so good to see you. It's so good to see yeah, you. I yeah. thought you didn't like me. I didn't see you last season. Well, oh, I didn't see you. Well, I, I have to go to his salon to go visit him. Yeah, uh, I, I, you broke my heart, just so you know. <laughs> I mean, I okay. you know. Okay. So we are at Tibby. We're backstage. It's the Fall Winter 2018 collection. We are in the coolest location. I mean, when I was coming over here, I was thinking this is like a CSI New York. Yeah, this <laughs> is a cool location. <laughs> yeah, a little scary. Rainy day, know. gloomy, but it's a cool location. Before we get into the hair, just yeah. do a little pan of this location because here you have the whole Aveda team behind you, and then everybody doing all this hair and makeup and nails, and then they get to look at on the Brooklyn Bridge. It's right. really cool, yeah. And not lots of space, which is unusual. It's nice. Yeah. It's nice when you don't have to like fall over everyone, so. Yeah, and I know I'm doing all this when you only have three minutes. No, 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 we're good, actually. I, I'm like really on time, so I'm, okay. I'm really so, good. Okay, so break down the look for us. Okay, so with Bruna, what we did is, you know, Amy, Amy's really very, specific with hair I mean you know like you work with a lot of designers some have no opinion to hair some have a lot she has a lot and her girl is always about their own natural look which from a hairdresser standpoint it's not the most technically challenging hair to do it's more of how do you manage and how do you get that texture um, with Bruna all we did is we used texture tonic in the hair I sprayed it in she came in her hair was frizzy I just ran like just a big round brush through the hair just to kind of get the frizz out and then just work the texture tonic and then I'm going to use texture cream from Aveda just to give some separation. It's really all about cool girl hair but it can't look like a blow dry. Okay, and I mean so everybody has something special and unique. I saw girls with short hair yeah. and curly hair. Curly hair, short hair. Um, some girls I just pulled their hair back in a messy little bun. So, you know, it's she likes individuality. You know, and I've been doing the show, I've been working with her I think for like 10 years. So you, you get to know the designer, you get to know what they like and it's really my job what I always look like, it's just managing the end result, you know? All right, so let's just show this again, because yes. then I'm going to, uh, to hit you with another question. What trends are you seeing so far this season? I've seen some very interesting trends. You know, I think, you know, hair for me is, it's, it's kind of like, it changes, but it doesn't. I mean, and I kind of go from, you know, a celebrity standpoint where it's always about glamour, but I always see this undone look to the hair and this coolness to it. And I know that's my own terminology, which sometimes you're like, well, what does he even mean by that? But I mean, I, I just see hair, um, I see hair a little bit more loose, you know, a little bit more playful a little bit undone I mean any know. other trends like one thing that I've been seeing at a lot of the shows that there are real models like real people mo as models oh, like okay. this is I unusual mean, because oh, yeah, you've got I mean, real well, models. I think I, I, I if you're talking from that standpoint I think the whole model fashion thing is just completely different today I mean it's not I don't think when you say models I mean yes there's always be models but I think real people I mean it's just like now with with anything else bloggers and influencers they've become sometimes the model you know so uh, you know from that perspective it's completely different you know where you I mean when I started and you know, we're talking back in the day you asked me like who's like my inspiration and I remember like my first fashion show and I did Christy Turlington's hair like to me her Kate Moss they are still the icons of they were the day of the models you know and obviously today they're still models and not that you aren't fabulous yes, no, you no, are no, so yes, fabulous. Yes, yes. Please, we don't want to give Bruna a complex. She don't want to walk away and say, I hate that hairdresser, you're real ass. You know, but I'm, you know, when we're talking really about, when you look at like a shift in trend, I mean, hair changes season to season. There's some, I mean, American hair is always a little bit more cash than let's say more European hair. Yeah, you're seeing some braids and some more kind of extreme looks, but it's, it's really, who's your girl now? That's kind of really, or who's your boy? Celebrating what they have going on, whatever they are. And that's great, you know. Salon. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's to be contrived and making yeah, people what they yeah. are. I mean, I think that, you know, from that perspective, you know, as an artist, as a hair artist, you have to be, and especially someone that started in the industry at a different time, you know, you've got to be just completely open to whatever's new and interesting, you know. So. Making kind of fun. All right, how do people follow you? Um, Frank Rosieri on Instagram. Yeah. It's at Frank Rosieri. It's Frank Rosieri inst on, on Instagram. You know. Where are you in New York? I know you work yeah. in a salon. We have a salon. It's on 14J Street. It's called 14J. 14J. All right. I'm going to go there. I've been to his. He has this fabulous setup in Marlton, New Jersey. Mar no. no Morristown. We Morristown. were in Marlton. Marlton. What, what, is, what town is it? Uh, Morristown. Morristown. Not, not Morristown. Morristown. M-O-R-R-E-S. 
school, and he's somebody school. that you should, if you want to get into the business, that's a, a great place tools. to go. Our session tools. Our session tools, which we should point out. You well, guys, this is the... Our session mat. And the, br and the brush. And, and, and the brush. The, what's really cool about this mat is if you put a hot appliance... Well, you tell. Yeah, well, I actually, I change it now. It's just, a, yeah, because it's a bigger mat, and what happened is I had a mat that changed color, but... In extreme heats, it would stay that color, so we had to change that. So. <laughs> little you know, design. I, sh I should have done a little pre-interview yes. here. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. We're friends, so it's, it doesn't matter. Our session tools. Yeah. Uh, really cool line of hair appliances for hairdressers They're by really hairdressers. for hairdressers by hairdressers, yeah. Hairdressers. Yeah. Frank, thank you so thank much you for so this much. time. Yeah. Thank you for being our model. You and you have a great show. Yes, thank yeah. you. All right, bye-bye.